short in your uh, sponsor's list you have at the box, right? I was extremely fanatic about hack this site dot I don't know if you guys know about it. Hack this site dot right? Very similar to hack the box, but those days talking about. Uh, site was the at the box kind of a uh, right? and it had close to 88,000 uh, hackers constantly trying to crack challenges they have HTML challenges, they have JavaScript challenges, they have reverse engineering EXE challenges they had uh, multiple challenges, EXE challenges they had uh, PCAP file challenges PCAP as in network capture file Multiple such challenges, and you know what? I single handedly cracked all the challenges, ranked number one for six consecutive months out of the 88,000 hackers. Right? And I really got a high doing that. Wow, you understand what I'm saying? That's a kind of a feeling. And I uh, started to uh, explore this Google docking. You know this Google docking? What is Google docking? How many of you have heard of Google docking? Google docking is otherwise called Google hacking or it's called the GHDB, Google hacking database, right? So you use Google to search for some keywords which are potential links of a vulnerable site. You understand? Yes or no? If I search your phone number, okay, office or college landline number on Google, will it show me your college link? Yes or no? Yes or no? Then think of this, there is a password hash that I am searching. If there is someone whose password is hacked somewhere on the internet, will I get it? Yes or no? That's exactly what happens in Google Docs. We try to search for sensitive information. True? Proper surface web for the Google. Okay. What I did was I was not uh, that uh, calm kid who sits in the first row. I used to be that notorious kid sitting in the last of Marble Bench. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech insights on cybersecurity.